Welcome back again to Shogun Total War 2, Fall of the Samurai. Sorry, Vaddy Vaddy Richie has not been able to watch some of my videos recently. That's a shame, isn't it? I don't, I don't quite know what's going on there, I really don't. Um, I've, had, I've been having a quick look around at how to move these ships about. And I, I think what I'm going to do is spare you the misery of all this. Um, it's going to take a while, isn't it, to move all of these. Um, I think they're pretty okay. What I need to do is strip out... I'm just going to show you what I'm going to do first. I'm going to strip these out of here because it's going to take me a pain to do. Uh, no, not out of that. I can get one out of Boozen. Perhaps two. I'd have to check that out. I'll probably get two out of Boozen. Put them on these ships here. Take them up to there. Put these on here. Right. And then what I want to do is move them across as far as I can. Um, I don't know if I'm even going to be able to reach with this ship here. I might not quite be able to get up that far, but I don't know if they can reach that. Yeah, they can just about reach, can't they? So I, I might be in with a chance of just picking them up there on the way, but we'll see what we get up to anyway. So the idea is to put them on this ship, um, get all one of those ships. Get In fact, I'll move one of those across there. Um, so you can pick him up and then bring him into here and then move on from there, I think, so this one stays the same. Okay, so that's what I'm going to do. Um, I've got some more troops over here, you'll remember, and that's... Uh, where are they? These here. And I've got some from... oh, no, that's not... from Izumo as well, I seem to remember, there. Um, that I've still got some spare in here, just one I've got in there. So what I'm going to do is get him over to this ship here and then join onto there and join onto here and leapfrog the whole lot over to somewhere down here and I'll show you when we get there who I've got where otherwise I'm fiddling about with this one putting the gunboat back, gunboat back and you've seen that all before it does take a lot of video time and um, I'm, once it's been seen it's, it's on the last video I think it's on the one before and the one before that even um, so certainly in the last five videos there's two or three occasions that this has happened so um, I, I don't really see much point in showing that again and it does take some time so okay a couple of minutes just explaining what I'm going to do instead of ten minutes doing it back shortly Okay, that took about 10 minutes, would you believe? We're all the way over to here now, and um, it's just getting these guys where they're going to go from here. They're almost there. I'm tempted to just bring them up to there. In fact, I'm going to do it. Yeah, bring the gunboat up to there with the army on it. I haven't got both armies. There was um, a bit of a gap in gunboats, and I couldn't get those all the way over from Nagato, or Nagato, whatever you call it. Um, so I'm going to get him to come round. I really want the troops to go into Noto here. Um, there is a reason for that. It's um, basically because I want to defend this place with the poor quality troops that I'm bringing around. These are not good ones, these. So I'll bring him around. I think I've got all this area covered. So I have n Oh no! I've left him behind. How stupid was that? Oh, how stupid was that? I brought the wrong one round. Can I still get him there? Um, I could perhaps send another ship, this one. That's probably wise, actually. Yeah, up to there. Okay, and he can pick them up. Right, and this time move him, which is what I should have done last time. Okay, and then take out the 26 gunner. And the 26 gunner still can't reach that port but he might just be able to join up with there if he can then the ships from here can pick him up and bring him into the port can't they is he going to join yes excellent okay so all i really need now is just one ship from there to go out into it i'll take them both out doesn't really matter to me both of them out to there and uh, i want to keep one of them let's keep the 14 gunner um, Yep, good. So the 14 gun should be the one with the army on. Move him into... Where's the port gone? There it is. Okay. Right, and bring the army out of there into here. I hope they can reach into there. Oh no. I think some of them will be able to reach, you know. It's just the way I've done it. So let's get those to join those. So I've got my own little navy there, which is very nice. And then I'll just recruit a gunboat in here, I think. Just to move troops around on. Gunboat, where are you, gunboats? Come on, so, show me where you are. It's got to be... Yeah, that's it, of course. Right, okay. Um, 
and I'll leave those out there. They're pretty decent size themselves, aren't they? Two twenty-six gunners, you know, both ironclads. So I mean, they're pretty good. And these are copper-plated as well. So, and that's a twenty-six gunner. That's a pretty substantial little uh, fleet. That one, actually, I'm quite pleased with that. Okay, now let's find out which troops I can bring from here. Um, ah, they can all do it. They're well past it, the look of it. So two, four, six, two, four, six. I can get seven in there. So if I bring one, two, th one, two, three, four, five, six out of there, but what are they on? Minus one. So that would give them minus seven, wouldn't it? Let's see what happens if I bring those out then. Um, to join maybe with this guy here. Ready for battle. Okay. Minus seven. Okay. Now let's see if we can get these in here, because if I can't, it's not going to be a big deal because I can always pop those troops back in there, can't I? The ones I've just taken out. Aha! And they've gone yellow. That's brilliant. Okay, they're probably going down another point next turn, so we'll move this one in as well. Uh, and then I've got these free. So now, sorry, I've got these free, haven't I? So I'm going to bring these over to, um, uh, well, over to here, I suppose. Why can't they move? Oh, some of them can. Right, okay, I'll move the ones that I can then. At once. Ah, can't get all the way. Well, that's a bit of a pain, actually, because I wanted to get those troops out of there. Uh, I wanted to start moving on. Uh, never mind, it'll have to be next turn that we do that then. Now, these troops are a bit wasted as well. I've got... Uh, what have I got in there? Nine. I think... Oh, sorry, I'm on nine in terms of value, I should say. Uh, I think we're pretty safe around here, aren't we, really? So, I think what I'll do then is take out my nine. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Oh, hang on. Blast. Click the wrong one then anyway, but let's have a quick check, see if they're going down. Yeah, they're going from minus three to four. I can only really take eight out of there. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So let's take eight out instead then. Uh, perhaps join them up with these here. I wonder if I can get all the way in. Uh, it's because of the way the roads go, isn't it? Uh, it doesn't matter. I, I'm, I'm quite happy with that, I think. Okay, um, is that a gunboat I haven't put in place yet? Put back, rather? Yes, it is. So just nick that one back. I'm pretty safe now in that sea up there, so I'm, I'm being a bit blasé about all of this, thinking, well, it doesn't matter really if I leave them out of ports now. And that's what I've been doing, really. Um, plenty of ships around here, so don't need to worry about that. And I think... I thought I'd put them all back in port, but like I said, he's spare, so I think what I'll do is just... Um, just leave him there, really, to be honest, because I don't actually need him at the moment. Let's put him somewhere in the centre, then he can move quicker or something. Actually, it might have been an idea if I'd have put him up here. Um, and if I can still do that, I think I will, actually. Yeah, let's put him up here. No, because I've still got that one. Oh, come on, think about what you're doing. Of course, I've got this one as well, haven't I? So, right, OK, end of. Uh, am I recruiting that gunboat? Yes, I am. Good. I know I found it. <laughs> Just double-checking. Um, before somebody says, oh, you've terrible memory. It, it's not that, you know. It's double-checking all the time. It's not so much forgetting, but double-checking. There's got to be um, a useful rhyme in there somewhere, isn't there? It's not so much double-checking. No, it's not so much forgetting as double-checking. Why can't I attack that? Oh, I can. Sabotage. 66%. I think it's worth going for that. Oh, failed. <laughs> oh, well, it was worth a try. Um, I thought he might gain some experience, but he obviously hasn't done. No, I don't know what to do with him. He's supposed to be coming down here, but I don't know if I still want him to now. Oh, hang on. It looked like he went yellow then, but he's not. No, he's red, isn't he? So, OK, right. Um, I think that is about it for up there. We've now consolidated Noto. Noto's now a happy place. He should still be moving in there. Yes, he will be. The other ship is way back here that I couldn't move any further forward. Oh, gone past him. Here. He's got some pretty decent troops on. They're the ones from Nagato that I couldn't get in last time. So, um, that'll be quite a handy force, won't it? Now then, what else did I want to do? Um, 
yeah, I think that's about it, actually. That's all I've got planned for this turn. I mean, apart from the obvious, you know, I've got to, you know, uh, sort out any of his armies around here. What I want to do is get rid of any enemy um, agents, particularly geishas that might take away my generals or anything like that, or pay off my armies and things. And I'm pretty sure it's that one. Should we try it? Yes, my lord. This one? No, it's not that one. This one. Impossible, my lord. What do you mean impossible? It's not impossible. Aha, this is the one I want anyway. Right, okay. I want a fairly easy right, that's the one I want. Fifty one percent. It's uh Shinsengumi. Um, which is one of those that can buy off my troops. Uh, I could sabotage the army as well. I'm not going to do that. I'm going to go for him. See if I can get him. Oh, brilliant. That's great. Well, that means now it should be easier. Oh, yeah, good. It should be easier now for my... Um, uh, let's just improve him first. Um, yeah, it should be easy for my geishas to sabotage his army now, because he hasn't got those agents in there. Plus one subterfuge when sabotaging buildings, when establishing spy networks. This one is subterfuge when sabotaging armies. Chance of shinobi will be... Oh, I'm going to go for that one, because we might do it to armies, mightn't we? So let's go for that. Okay, now, um, another one over here. Wow. See what chance he's got of getting somebody. Can he move? Yes, he can. And it was these, wasn't it? Assassinate, yep. Okay, his chances should be improved now that we've got rid of that one. That's a general. Shinsengumi. Now, that's not a good chance, that, really. 38%. I'd like something a little better than that. Um, see if I can get another agent from somewhere. What, what about him? He can move, can't he? It's not good, is it? That's 30%. I think the other one was 38%, wasn't it? God, you know, I can't even find him in this mess. Um, is he the one that's already gone? Already, yeah, he is, isn't he? I can't find him now. I know there's another agent here somewhere. Ah! Is that it? I don't know. Anyway, assassinate. Yeah, he's 38%, isn't he? Let's go for that one, then. Okay. Ah, that's good as well. See, my, my problem is, and this is the reason why I'm doing this, is that, is that if he's got Shinsengumi, if they, and he's got money as well, he can buy my armies, and that's not a good thing. So, um, And he also spreads the um, Shogun influence as well, so I, I don't want that either. So let's see now if I can get rid of... A general. I think that's all that's left, isn't it? Yeah, generals. 57% chance. So if I get rid of one of these generals, that should make it even easier for my geishas then to do their, their work. Oh, failed. Never mind. I, we've got enough out of our um, uh, shinobi, really. Let's just give him some extra talent. What are we going to give him? Subterfuge when assassinating. Chances of escape following an unsuccessful. Let's give him more subterfuge. Um, and on here, subterfuge when sabotaging buildings, subterfuge when establishing spy networks, subterfuge when sabotaging armies. Yeah, that's the one we're going to go for again. Okay, well, I think that's it for the um, spies in that area. Let's just have a quick look. No, Shinobi, I should say. Um, I, I might have another one somewhere else, but no, I think that's it, isn't it? Yeah, that's it. Uh, quick look down, quick look down, quick look down, anything else? No, 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 nothing else. Right, okay, so now we're on to the geishas. Um, ah, now, um, the important ones are the bigger armies, but I'm not too worried if any of his armies get through. I've probably said this before, haven't I? Because I want to be able to take them on, really. I want him to come and attack me. That would be the best thing. So let's try this one first at the back. No, not with him. I want it with her. Against this one. Distract army. 57% chance. It's not bad, is it? It's not brilliant. I could have enchanted. That means he's got a general in there as well, doesn't it? Ah, good. So that's that one done. One down. About four to go. <laughs> right, okay. Um, she can distract, hopefully, 
this one. 68% chance, that's good. Brilliant. Now she can then distract this one. 79% chance, that's also good. Oh, failed. Ah, right, okay. Well, maybe I'll bring her around to do that one, because she's only small, isn't she? she, she well, I say small, she's less experienced, and it's only a small army. 62%. We'll try that one. I should really use her on the blue one. Oh, it's worked. That's good, isn't it? Right, okay. Um, so now there's only one left. There's only one geisha. I think it's her. Come on, please. Yes, it's her. So all those armies are distracted now, except for the... well, the blue one isn't. Do I distract this one here? I'm tempted to go for this one here and leave the, the blue one, hopefully, to come and attack me. I don't think he will, but 79% chance that's also very good, isn't it? Right. Brilliant. So all he's got to attack me with now is the blue army, which I hope he does. Um, if not, we'll just cram him into a position there. I'm quite happy with that. That's not a problem for me. Uh, so look down here. What have we got? Uh, veterans, foreign veterans. That's all we've got down there. And I, I think that's about it, to be honest with you. I really do. Ah, now one thing I'm a bit concerned about. I've been looking up these um, uh, matchlock towers on the encyclopedia. And I'm going to get one in three turns time. The only problem is, well, the main problem I've found, is that um, you can't have one uh, without a slot available to put one in. And, I don't know, that, that's a thousand wealth. It's pretty good, isn't it? Happiness, everything, that's a pretty good thing, that. And it gives me geisha. Um, what I really need is um, a large town in here to, to give me... Oh, Starfort, I can't get yet. To give me another appointment slot. So, not appointment slot, construction slot, I suppose is the word, isn't it? So I'm going to go for that. It's eight turns away. I can't imagine myself still holding on to this in eight turns. I really can't, but... Oh, I don't know, you never know. Um, it's highly unlikely. This place as well. Basically, it's because I want to build the matchlock towers. I want to see what they look like, but I haven't really got an option to put them anywhere at the moment. Inn is useful to me, and I think I need another construction slot. So... Let's go for it here as well then, and we can get a, a better stronghold in there as well. Um, I'm wondering if it's worth also getting um, another ship in there, or getting a ship in there rather. He's quite a distance away from me, isn't he? In it? I don't know, I don't know if a gunboat will come in handy or not really. No, I'm going to leave it. I am going to leave that. At some point, these ships on the top right map again now, uh, these ships that I've got round here, that I got to attack anybody that manages to get through here, um, I need to bring those forward really. I could do with them bombarding enemy troops in places. In fact, I'll tell you what, they might come in quite in, come quite in handy to do that. Come in quite handy, I should say, to do that as well, shouldn't they? You know, when I start to move these troops forward, if I do, I might even come down. I really don't know yet, but I think that's the end of that one. Let's just have a look, see... Um, uh, what the turn M brings on. I'm tempted also, by the way, to bring some troops from over here. In fact, I might start that now, actually. How many have I got in there? I'm on a plus two, and is it going to go down or up? Non-clan alignment, minus two. So, I don't think... Minus four, minus... Th I think I'm safe enough to bring two out of there, you know? Everything else seems to be staying the same. I think so. Let's take two out of there, uh, these better ones. Uh, over to the ships, uh, if they can reach. I'm not sure, I wonder if it's quicker this way. No, it can't be, surely. No, one, two, three, four turns to get that way. I'll take them by sea. Sorry, sir, but we cannot. What are you waiting for? Come on. Of course. Yeah, it's not quite yet, is it? So, Well, that's probably not so bad, actually, because I can always move them back if I have a problem. You know, uh, but I don't, I don't think I need troops at the back there. I'm sure I should be able to defend this place without having um, troops at the back. There isn't anything I can build with these, is there? No kind of fortress, is there? Uh, just a bit concerned something might try and go past me. I'm not too concerned, because I'm hoping it will, really, in a way, because then I can go and attack it, can't I? Piecemeal. Anyway, next turn, it's going to be a case of swapping these ships around, isn't it? And getting those men into there, just to reinforce this garrison a bit, because I can't get any of the kind of troops that I want in there. You can get troops in there. 
but they're not really the kind that I want. I have no idea what's around here. He could be building up quite a substantial little army there, couldn't he? But Okay, well, let's see what the turn end brings on. Oh, I think we might just be in the spring. Give me a chance to drink my tea before it goes cold as well. Crikey, that's uh, 20 minutes and I've been cutting, out, cutting away the time as well. Do you know, I forgot about those troops from Omi in the centre. Oh, two big armies coming down here from these again. You've got to suffer attrition on there, which is good for me. Uh, and he's getting even more armies in the centre there. <laughs> if I could be sure that, uh, that, uh, that, that strangling somebody's economy would work, and it never really has in any of the Total War games, then I'd start attacking places around that. And leave that as a kind of Berlin in the middle, you know, um, so that it's um, you know it absorbs all those resources. Uh, right, okay. Uh, should I be detected? What's the cost of fortune for the Americans to keep uh, Berlin going, flying in supplies all that time? Army distracted. Right, some men's hearts are weak. Right, a rival geisha distracted us. Is it this one? Well, I'm not worried about the uh, the army being distracted. What I am concerned about is a geisha being there. I could do really with perhaps sending a spy out there to go and sort her out. Let's suppose I can recruit any more, can I? I recruit one now. I think I've got my maximum number of spies, really. I can't even remember where I can get them from. Never mind. Uh, actually, I think one place I know I can get them from is here. Yeah, no, I've got my maximum number. Okay, well, the one thing I talked about doing, still on yellow, so that's good, is bringing these over. Just um, supporting this place a little bit more. I don't think it really needs it, but why not? Um, I'm wondering where to bring them in, actually. To bring them in here, or to bring them in there. So what I'm going to do is bring the ships up a little. Right and then choose the men and see which route it tells me is the quickest. Um. Oh great, it's going to tell me to drop them on the land there. That's stupid, isn't it? I can't see that being right at all. Okay, well let's see which is the quickest if I w were to move them from here. Um. Right, they only go that far here. Okay, whereas they go all the way over there on here. I think this is going to be the best route, you know. The road goes up there, though, and then across here. Let's try it a different way. Let's try choosing the actual port and see what happens. Okay, if he's going to the port, he goes, oh, he goes straight there. Okay, well, it's a small route, short route, and this one... It looks even shorter. <laughs> it's much of a muchness, isn't it, really? I just don't know. Oh, blimey, I pulled him out now as well. Don't want him out of there. Get back. Okay, um, I'm going to go for this one then, um, because at least I know he'll eventually get there. So let's bring him over to here. Um, so we'll just swap them round. And then this one into there. Okay, it's just um, an admin type thing, this really. I, I don't think it's really necessary, but um, might as well if I can. Oh yeah, they'll go all the way, won't they? Very good. Oh no, they won't. <laughs> Never mind, they'll get in next turn. Well, I, it was just strengthening the garrison a little bit, that's all. One, two, three, four, five musketeers in there. Five units of musketeers. Well, that will make them seven with a general, plus the garrison. I, I, that that will probably give them about 13 in there. I, th I think they're going to be pretty substantial, really, especially if they actually build that, um, um, what is it, um, the matchlock towers as well in there. So, Okay, right, um, it's what I do now. Uh, it's, oh, right, okay, the other thing was those ships that were out that, but blimey, what am I doing? That ship that was over here, wherever it is. Uh, it's not that one, because that's got troops on it. So where's it gone? <laughs> I've got a ship around here somewhere that's got um, troops on. I think and hope. Uh, I don't know where it's gone now. Come on, where are you? 
Um, he's part way there. It should... I'd have thought it would have been that one, but it's not, is it? Um, there. That's where he is. Brilliant. Okay. Uh, what am I going to do with this one? Bring them over somewhere. Um, into here, possibly. And then bring that ship out. Are there any troops I can bring from here? No, they're just yellow. Right, now... Bring that one out to here. Um, this one... I should have said I'll do all this off-camera, shouldn't I, again, but... I've started to all finish, so... Right, okay, that one's there. Didn't need that one leaving there at all, did I? But, at least I can move him back. Uh, to the place that that one's vacated. So we'll get him over to... I don't need him in there. Maybe... Yeah, I'll put him in there. Okay, just a bit of tidying up, really. Um, this one into here, I think. Proper. I don't think I will, actually, you know. I think I'll probably put him in here. That's probably going to be the best place for him. No, it isn't. What am I thinking of? He can go back in there. Okay, so that one out of there. This one from here over into here. Okay, and then this one here with the troops on. He should be able to, with a little bit of luck, get somewhere useful now, can he? Almost, do you know, he can almost reach that ship there. <laughs> but I don't need him to. What I need him to do is go part way, just up to here. Yeah, it's a good job I, I did do the first one off camera, wasn't it? Otherwise I'd have been doing this twice on the same video, so... Right, okay. Um, I didn't realise it was going to be as complicated as this, this one. So, put him back into there. Like I said, I'm fairly secure in this area now, so I'm not too worried about putting ships back into their ports. It doesn't really, uh, um, well, it's not really as significant as it is when the waters are hostile, is it? So, right, okay, well, he can actually reach there now. So I think it makes the most sense to move him directly to there. Right. Oh. It would. If he could reach. Well, he can't reach. Right, okay. Right, now he can go... back to whence he came, which is, what, here? Perhaps? This one... Um, I don't know. I really don't know. Back into that port, I suppose. Doesn't really make that much difference. Um, right, and then this one here with the troops on. Can he reach anywhere useful now? Well, he can get to here. And here is pretty useful, actually, because... Um, I c well, here, anyway, is pretty useful. Maybe I'll just drop them here. Uh, yeah, I think so. And then just march the army across from here. And just backfill that with poor... I'm going to say they're not actually poorer quality troops, these, actually, now I think about it. They're not at all. Anyway, Noto, no, <laughs> Noto is already sort of looked after, so I don't need to worry about those, do I, really? So, okay, let's get these into here, then. Uh, yep. And I think I'll just leave all those there. Don't think I need them anywhere else. I might actually... Do you know, I could have moved all the way up. I could have moved them to there, and then on to there, and then round to here. But I, I don't, just don't think I need to. What have I got in here now? I've got six. And that's going to stay at minus four, so we're okay there. I can take six out of there anyway. One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay. And they're pretty close to getting into there, aren't they? So... Make haste, man. Do you know what I just did there? I just moved troops that have already moved. And I could have just taken the ones out that were already in there. Never mind. You know what I mean? Now, what I'm saying is these have probably got more movement. Yeah, they have. See, two of them have got more movement. <sighs> Never mind. Okay. Um, we're part way there, anyway. You see what I mean? I could have got almost all the way there. Right, okay, these troops here... I'm going to advance them to a point where hopefully they can cover... Oh, they can't. Look at that. Unless they get all the way to... I don't think they're going to be able to. What I'm saying is, I don't think they're going to be able to cut off... Oh, they can. Just there. They block any army getting through, don't they? There. I think that's going to be it, yeah, just... 
there because they can't get into there can they no right okay I think that's the area there just there where they're going to go to yep okay so that blocks anybody getting through that area there so he's just going to um, lose an hey why is he doing that now that's showing now like he can get through isn't it it's like he can get through there I'm not too sure about that, exactly how that's worked out. But anyway, let's move some of these troops in here, the ones that I can get into here. Um, okay. Come on, don't mess me around now. Right, okay. It's a pretty decent sized defence of that place, isn't it? Not that they even need it. Um, I think, yeah, that's on green. He can probably reach as well. Yes, he can. It's a pretty strong place that. He's going to move in as well. Um, and actually, I want him to move further. How many have I got in there now? Plus two, and they're going to—they're improving. Actually, they're going to go to minus three from minus four. So I can bring two out. Let's bring these two out over to here. Oh, they didn't reach. That's odd. Why didn't they reach? Hmm. Never mind. Okay, uh, they're on yellow now, so... Okay, just put that one in there. Good. That's quite handy having that gunboat there, you know. It's like a kind of port, isn't it? That springboard. Especially now I've got these around here as well. It's pretty good. Hey, I can bring those over. <laughs> oh, yeah. I could support my own infantry with these... The, with, with a battery from there. I could even go in and fire at them. I wonder if I should do that anyway, actually. Oh, I fire at them, that would be good, and but then he could attack me um, without me having the naval bombardment. But to be truthful, do I really need a naval bombardment when he attacks me there, if I'm defending? I don't think I do, you know. I'm just going to go in and blow him up. Why not? <laughs> okay. Right. What? Why did it fail to cause any damage? Really, really good quality ships there. Oh, that's great. Now he can go and attack my, my men, can't he? Without me having the fire support. Oh, you can't have everything though, can you? I think I've got a full 20 in there, and I'm pretty sure I have. 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19. Yeah, okay. For all those people that, that knew what that was and can tell me I've counted it numerous times, then just remember the old thing, you know, that you... What is it? Measure twice, cut once. So, let's just take a decent amount out of here. I don't need too many out of here, really. I could take a lot more out, really. Let's take out the good ones. Um, the best ones. Um, um, what, a couple of others, maybe? Yeah, why not? Okay. Just in support of this army here. I'm not going to need it. But... Ah, they're there, aren't they? Right, okay. Everything's happy there. Everything, all's well here. Brilliant, brilliant, brilliant. Uh, this guy here. Maybe I should sabotage that army over there, really. And keep it in my winter territory. Uh, sabotage. 66 or 68%. Not sure. Failed again. What's the matter with him? Come on. You're going to have to improve, man. He's very low even now, isn't he? He's got attributes though I don't quite know what's wrong with him right okay well let's get him looking at this place then just to see what's along here don't really see a lot of point really to be honest with you but oh right okay let's see what we can do um, assassinate maybe perhaps assassinate a general oh okay does he gain any points well, if he does, he's only going to go up to about there, isn't he? And it looks to me as though he's already gained them, so... No, nothing to be gained from that. But at least we can see who's there in North Shinobi. Is it? Shinano, sorry. Looking at this, nearly 3,000, so that's going to have an income of about seven, 700, 800 maybe, depending on the taxation system, so... OK, well, that, that's about it for all of those. What I could do now is distract some of his armies and then go in and attack one, but if I do that then... no, I don't think... it's just it's just not wise to do it, is it, really? I think I'm better off just leaving him there. It would be nice to tempt some of his units to come and attack me, though, wouldn't it? If I can... look at all these armies... one, two... 
I don't know about that one at the back. It looks fairly full. Three, four, five, six. He's got six, ar six full armies. And enough probably to make up a sevens in all of that lot. Facing one, two, three of mine. Possibly a fourth down here. So, crikey. In fact, now there's more that can come my way, isn't there? Uh, right, okay, well, if there are any sort of shinobi or anything like that around, I need to get rid of them. Let's sort out the shinobi first. My shinobi first. Do you know, I think this is going to be it when I've done this, because um, I, I was hoping to have a bit of a, a bit of a fight, but I don't think there's going to be a chance for one. Okay, let's see if I can um, kill some generals and shinobi and whatever else he's got. He's got geisha in there now. Ah, he must have recruited it inside that building, inside that town there. 79% chance of killing though, so that's pretty good. I'm going to go for that. Enemy assassinated, that's excellent. That's really good, that. Because that geisha, she could have turned the heads of one of my very experienced shinobi. You know, right, he's a long way away from getting anything. Let's see what they've got in here that gives them shinobi. Military academy, financial district, he hasn't got anything. He hasn't got anything in there that can give him them. Hmm. Okay, um, these guys here are going to be assassinating. Who can we assassinate in here? Uh, right, General, 65% chance, that's pretty good, let's get rid of him. Enemy wounded? Well, I'm happy with that. That's good enough. I don't think he appears next turn, does he? But, you know, or reappears, whatever. Um, and i got another one here. Can he have a go? Yep, seems so. So let's get him on this one here as well. And 56% chance now. Hmm, okay, go for this one then. Enemy wounded. Excellent. Oh, we're thinning out his numbers here, aren't we? Brilliant. It makes it easier, you see, to... Um, uh, to distract his armies if he hasn't got so many generals in them. I want to go for the rear ones. I want these armies of his to go forward and attack me. So I really want to start, um, you know, I want to leave those behind really and go um, having a go at some of these at the back. I might just have a go at that blue one with her. 68%. Okay. Yeah, good. Small army. It's good experience for her, you see, that's the thing. Ah, is she going to go up? Uh, she already has. Okay. Um. Uh, right. Okay. This one. Um. On to perhaps him. Maybe at the back. No. Is it him? Him. Yeah. Sixty-one percent chance is not brilliant, is it? Brilliant. Excellent. Right, now she can distract as well, I think. I don't think she's moved yet. And I want her. I'd love to bring him over to my cause, but I can't. Right, we have to whiz round and have a look at the army at the back there. Because there's one over here that's yellow. That's a big army. It's this one here, I think. I know it's not as big as that one, but we've already distracted that one, I think. I hope. Distract army. Oh, failed. Right, okay, well that army is going to come up at me then, I'm afraid. Um, unless I can distract it with one of these as well. Let's see what she can do. What would you have me do? Right, okay. Can she distract... I don't know which one it was I was going for now. Um, we seem to have turned round again, don't we? Um, I'm getting all mixed up now with all these flags, so I'm going to go for that one. Oh no, hang on. It's too far away. Um, distract army, 78% chance. I'm getting a bit mixed up now with which ones we've distracted, but I'm hoping I'm going for that yellow one, because I don't think I could see the yellow one before it's failed anyway, so it doesn't matter. Right, okay, um, let's see if we can distract with this one then. Someone who we know about. Maybe just this one here. 
I want to distract these big ones, this is the thing. Has anybody distracted him yet? Oh no, too far. Um, blast, too far. Um, it can't have to be one of these then, isn't it? I don't really want to distract any more of these, because I want these to come and attack me. Well, I kind of hope she fails and gains experience, really. Yeah, okay, well that's, that's not bad actually, that's okay, because it means I've got some people that are going to come out and attack me now. Trouble is, they're attacking me in spring now, aren't they, so it's not going to affect them badly. Right, okay, well that's it for, um, for all the actions on there. I don't know which way I'm facing now, so I'm going to turn myself around. Um, saw a great film last night, by the way, Memphis Bell. I've never seen the film. It's a really, really good film. I like it. It reminded me of the old um, British war films, you know, the Lancaster bomber type ones, you know, the bombing raid types, um, you know, like uh, the Bouncing Bomb and stuff, you know, the Barnes Wallace film. I don't, what do they call that? Um, oh, I don't know what they call it now, that film. Uh, but a brilliant film. And it, Dam Busters, that's it. They call it Dam Busters. Right, okay, well, I I'm going to stay here. Stay there. Um, he's already attempted. He's already attempted up there. All the agents have done what they need to do. I can't see that I need to move any other troops from anywhere else. These are reinforcing this place here. I wonder if it's worth just doing a turn end. Oh, 41 minutes. What if he attacks me somewhere? Well, at least we'll be able to see what's going to happen next video, won't we? So, okay. I think I'll leave it at that. See what happens. I want some of these armies to come out and attack me. He's got all three of those armies free now. He should come and attack me. Let's see if he does. In fact, he might even come and attack me up here as well. So, let's see what happens, shall we? Mainly because we're into spring, actually. I think this is now going to be spring. But if he attacks me, I'd like to have just one more turn of winter. So that he suffers a bit of attrition. Aha! He's coming! Ah, what happened then? He seemed to go past me. Or hide in the wood. He's gone past me! Oh, great! Oh, brilliant. Both armies have gone past me. Oh, that's not fair, is it? I looked at it, and I looked at how the the roundness of the, the red control of zone... Uh, the ro <laughs> control of zone. Zone of control was altered. Oh, she never detected. Yeah, okay, 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 okay. Why aren't you changing? Okay. I'm sure I didn't have that many shinobi. I must have been clicking slightly off the uh, the tick there. Right, okay, ah, well no, he didn't hide in the woods, I don't think. He did have three armies, that's that one there, so we're in spring. Well, I can attack him with this one, and I can attack him with that one. I don't. I think he consolidated some troops as well, by the look of it, didn't he? He's only got wooden cannons, that's probably why he didn't attack me directly. This army here, um, he's only got wooden cannons, um, so obviously they can't move. I don't know what the range of them is. I think it's just as good as mine, to be quite frank. But um, I, he's not going to be able to take me on, I don't think. I've got the Armstrong guns, which are more powerful than his. I've got some parrots, I'm afraid. But we get more ammunition and all sorts. So it's going to be a case of attacking him there and attacking him there. We're safe now because we're in spring, so we can move into his territories in order to, to complete these attacks. If I can distract some armies at the back here, um, I'm not sure if he can reach over to there. He can, actually. Yeah, okay. So, um, take out that one, take out that one, take out this one. I've got enough at the back defending the place. Ah, no. Ah, oh, no, he could sneak through with these. Ah, oh, blast. I'd need to distract those armies there, really, because I'm holding in this position. Now, that'd be fine if he couldn't get around me, but he's just going to go right round there, isn't he, and attack here, or he's going to come right round here and attack this. So, I really need to take him out. In fact, more than anything, I need to go this way with these. I wonder how many troops I can leave behind here. No, I haven't got any, have I? I could probably move those into there yes, to defend it. Yes, I could. And then I... <coughs> excuse me. Then I could attack with that army. <coughs> excuse me. Anyway, voice is going. So I think that's a good message that I've said enough for today. Cool, blimey. I'm going to need some water now. Anyway, thanks for watching, folks. A um, couple of battles on the next one by the look of it. Over here, and perhaps over at the top there.